Hi, welcome to Moshirina. In this short video, we're going to be looking at a new functionality that we have on the system that speaks with security rules. All right, security rules being a delicate uh, topic in finance and operations due to the fact that we need to make sure that we are giving access to the users for specific tasks that they are required to perform on the system. There are instances where we need to um, get access to a particular menu item or a particular process and give it to a user. Yeah, of course, the ERP comes out of the bus with several roles, privileges, and duties. Sometimes we would like to break down these roles or privileges or even duties and give just part of these privileges to a user. And getting the menu items the name of the tables and the rest of them sometimes can be quite tasky with a new functionality on the system administration model securities and then security diagnostics for tax recording we can easily identify the menu items that are needed to give access to user to perform a particular set of tasks or business scenarios on the system. First of all, we will need to have a recording using the tax recorder. So say for instance, I want to be able to identify the different rules that are, or the different duties, menu items that come into play while creating the customer. So I'll start my tax recorder, come to settings, tax recorder then I say create create recording so here for instance um, I want to be able to create a fixed asset so here I click on start then um, good so we'll come back to the modules we go to fix assets model fix assets then fix assets so um i'll simply do new let's create a new fix asset so here we'll pick uh, the fix asset group So I will just name this mine fix asset. Right. So I think uh, these are the basic things that we need to select while creating a fixed asset. Or right. I haven't done this, I can decide to I can stop the recording. All right? Click on stop. Then um, here we're going to save to this PC. We can as well save as a developer recording. Both of them works. Uh, because we are going to upload this recording later into the system to be able to get the necessary menu item or permissions to perform this task. Having done this, I can close my task recorder, then go back to system administration module, uh, securities, security, then security diagnostic for tax recording. So here, I'm going to upload my recording and the system will tell me the menu item that is required for me to be able to assess and create a fixed asset. So here it's telling me that the menu item required is access table, right? On this page, I can pick different users and the system will tell me if these users have access to this menu item or not. So say for instance, on this drop down, I pick Alicia. Now, this simply means that Alicia does not have the permission to create a fixed asset that's what it means so how uh, i can easily decide to see the roles or duties that contain this menu item display which is asset table so click on add reference the add reference shows the role so uh, when you give uh, alicia the auditor role for instance and this shell will be able to create a fixed asset. So these are all the rules that contains or that have access to 
a creation of a fixed asset and down we have duties then we have privileges on the privileges we have view asset record it simply means that when you assign this privilege to alicia alicia will be able to create fixed assets on the system now this comes handy when we have customizations that are done on the system when customization are done by the developer the developer will need to communicate the different menu items that have been done be it a display menu item an output menu item or an action menu item which cannot easily be recognized on the system on the url the developer will have to communicate all of these roles all of these menu items rather to the system administrator or the to the functional consultant before they can set up the rules for the newly created forms by the developer now with this security diagnostics anybody that has access to these menu items or to this form can simply upload the recording and through the recording you get all the menu of the display menu items the action menu items and even the output menu items and with that you can create your own custom roles add your privileges then assign the different permissions then give this role to the user so security diagnostics for tax recording it's actually a great tool that we can take advantage of for our security processes thank you very much